r slash am I the asshole? AITA for accepting a one-year medical school deferment so I can see if I can make a legit shot at an MMA career? Wife and parents might all divorce or disown me. Judgment, asshole. I can't give too much away about my situation because it would reveal where I am, but I started medical school this past week. Due to some clerical errors compounded by a faculty emergency, they asked for volunteers to take a one-year deferment. I accepted it, without asking my wife. For some background, I've always wanted to be a doctor. Both my parents are doctors, my wife is a nurse, and I really enjoy the medical field. But I love, love, love MMA. It's my passion. In fact, I had hoped to backdoor my way into an MMA career through medicine. I wrestled in high school, I'm a purple belt in jiu-jitsu, trained Muay Thai, and I'm 2-0 in amateur MMA. My MMA coach thinks I have a legit shot at turning pro off if I can lose 30 pounds and go into the flyweight division. The deferment offer seemed like a message from heaven. This is my chance to really focus on MMA, maybe pick up my pro card and see where it goes. For sure before I pick up all the school debt and am forced to be in medicine for the next 30 years, I will never get the shot again. We are more than comfortable living on my wife's salary and I may even be able to pick up some sponsors on Instagram. Well, wife is furious at me for not running this by her, and she thinks I'm basically putting our future in jeopardy if I get injured. My parents revealed to me that their plan all along was to pay for three years of school, so we aren't in debt, and they are furious with me. My wife and parents are like this joint, immovable wall, and everyone is mad. But what's done is done, and I can't take back the deferment. My dad found me a post-bachelor research position that might even get some experience to make M1 easier. My wife is demanding I take it. I want to train full-time. Am I the asshole? Oof, mate. Follow your dreams.